Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm April. This is Art by April. Okay, so today I wanted to talk about this piece, but I also want to discuss a Finish Friday update. Let's start with this piece. I wanted to do something wild, something colorful, something crazy with lots and lots of hair. Yeah, yeah. I got her at a three quarter view with lots and lots of uh, curly hair with highlights and different colors and Luna, what, what? I hear, I hear your concern. We're gonna be calm and we're gonna keep still. I love you too, I love you too. Okay, I love you too. Okay, so within the curls, there's, uh, she's got some dreadlocks and then I put in some, the gold rubber band detail details I picked up some uh, I made like a small little palette in the corner because I was thinking about her hair color and making sure they all kind of went with each other and it was kind of a, a pastel vibe and I, I mean yeah 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 and then and a couple of my pieces back I did a, like African print and with within the piece and so for the background I did that and highlighted everything in gold. I like how the piece turned out. Luna, but tell them how you were asleep five seconds ago. Before this camera got here, you were you were asleep, remember? I gave her a little bit of tattooing on the fingers and then on the neck and I was gonna do an earring, but then I forgot or I didn't come up with something I liked. and. Life happened. Then I took it uh, another step. I went back to the pastel palette, little hair colors there, and I uh, made those colors brighter and stronger and used them as her nails. Not her nails, but her, her nail polish, basically. But you know, you know what I'm talking about. Okay, so also, I wanna... The dog is crazy. The dog is crazy. So if you haven't been watching me for the past like year, you you wouldn't know about this, but I used to have a series on my channel called Finish Friday. And every Friday I would upload a video of me finishing a piece I had started but not had completed. There was one video called My Biggest Unfinished Project and uh, in the, oh my God. If you watch the video, you can really see that my anemia was so, so bad. It was so bad because I'm talking very slow. My movements are slow. I was, I looked back to the video. I was like, girl, go to the doctor. I'm glad I got that fixed. You know what I'm saying? Just, Cause I'm like, in the video, and like 30 pounds heavier, but that's not the point. The point is, is that in that video, I have this unfinished crocheted blanket and I would, I said I was gonna do updates on it and that's it, that's, that's what I'm gonna do now. Okay, I'm gonna show you some pictures of the progress and the finished piece, it's done. And it was for my best friend, Crystal. No, it wasn't for you. Even though you laid on it the entire time I was making it. I'm pretty sure Crystal does not appreciate all the dog fur Luna left on it, even though I, cl I cleaned it, I cleaned it, and it's still, it's, it was still there. The blanket was for her. It was supposed to be for her birthday like four years ago when she asked for it. But then I also had neuropathy that set in in my hands and, and my feet and then... And every time I touched the yarn, it felt like my fingers were burning and I was like, this isn't gonna work out. So I had to get that fixed and then years went by and I was so determined last year with anemia and no energy to get it to her and it just did not happen. But I felt like uh, with me having plenty of iron and on the right pills for my neuropathy, I could squeeze this out in quarantine. You know what I'm saying? I could just. So what I'm saying is happy birthday, bestie, Crystal, I love you. And I'm sorry it took four years for that gift you asked me for. Luna's being suspiciously quiet. 
Okay, let's, let's go back to the time lapse so we can wrap this video up because I'm pretty sure she's doing something I don't like. As each art piece goes by, I find that I have less hurdles. I, I remember at the beginning, I was just like, I don't know how to do this or I don't know how to get something to look a certain way or a certain style or a certain aspect was like beyond my reach and I feel like I've learned to manipulate these images and because that's I feel like that's what mostly these digital pieces are just manipulating over and over again something oh yeah I don't know if you like the piece go ahead like the video share subscribe all that goodness if you just don't want to see me talking you don't care for these time lapses you just want to see pictures you can follow me on my Instagram art by April <laughs> or my TikTok, April by Design. <laughs> if you're interested in buying or purchasing a print or a sticker or, or what have you, those products are on my Society6, which I don't ever promote for some reason. Do I not like money? Like, Thanks so much for watching. I gotta go and take Luna for some playtime because I know she's tearing something up. Luna? Okay, yeah, bye.